Welcome. I'm just going to briefly go over how to download a Word document or PDF from uh, one of the assignments in the course. For this example, I'll use 414, which is a CCNA3 assignment. So you can click on 414 here. You should see 414 here at the top. This is an ACL demonstration. You'll need to download the packet tracer file here. And then this is the PDF. So I can click on this. You have the print option here if you're using Chrome, a different web browser might look a little bit different. Um, if you're having any trouble, you can also hit this open in a new window. And then you can print from here as well. Another cool shortcut is Control P. And then you'll want to make sure your destination is save as PDF. Um, some computers may have Microsoft uh, save to PDF or download as PDF or something like that. And then of course you hit save. You can hit uh, browse wherever you want to, hit save. I'll go ahead and replace the document that I downloaded earlier. And if I can find my, there it is. So then I will right click this. If I open it, it'll open with edge here. And well, I can't, can't edit stuff. So I can right click and open with and now a word's not showing up, but I can hit choose another app. And I can scroll down more apps and I'll find Microsoft Word right there. That'll give me a warning. It'll say, we'll, we'll now convert it to a Word document. Um, the resulting Word document will be optimized to edit the text and look, might not look exactly like the PDF, but hopefully pretty close. We'll hit okay there and it will generate a Word document, which now we can go and answer questions and say, hey, um, the router was turned well, turned off. Um, so that's not actually the answer to that question, but that's how that will work. Um, some of the PDFs when they're generated are gonna have white here, so you have to change the text color to black. Some people will also highlight it or make it another fancy color like red for their answers. So that's how you generate a Word document. And after there, of course, um, you should be able to just save as, and then, you know, put your name in here and submit it after that. Let me know if you have any questions.